All right, people, welcome back. More webcam duels. So, uh, if you guys remember, we had like one episode of Red Icy Battle, and that deck did not work. This guy's name is Daniel. I'm Daniel. <laughs> so, I decided to go ahead and come back and well, work on the deck and come back. Ooh, Teller Knight. Sorry. Well, I lose. This hand is not the best either. It just click claw. You see, this is what I'm worried about with the deck. The, the, the deck is going to clog with these high level monsters. That is literally what I'm worried about. But, uh,. Overall, this hand's not bad. Oh, we got card of red duel, so I can go ahead and play that. Pitch you. Draw two. No. Uh, actually, I'd prefer not to. And what I drew into is not the best of what you could draw either. All right, so let me think, let me think, let me think, let me think. I mean, I'm probably going to lose this duel, but really, I just want to test the consistency of the deck. So, Dark Graffer is still in here, so I can go discard, special summon, discard. No. I can do all those things. One for one can summon me... Uh, the red eyes, uh, what's its face? The black metal, black metal, pitchy bell, because, uh, you know, totally don't need that. Like I said, I'm gonna, I'm definitely gonna lose this duel, but I just wanted to test out the consistency of the deck. That's, that's literally all I wanted to do. Like, there's no way in fuck I'm gonna beat Knights. Teller Knights are so damn powerful. You know, they're, they're the second best deck in the game right now, surprisingly. Okay, well, I still get my effects, so that's all I care about. So, go ahead and drop your bell. Yep. Look at that. Look at that. He just fucked me up. He fucked me up, and I can just go, you know, ult high air, summon, do all that shit again. He's got another dab. Alright. That's fine. You know, I could go for terror, and, you know, even if he trips me, I should be okay. Like I said, I'm, I'm gonna lose this duel, but... Oh, you already normal summons, so it's not like you can get any additional summons. You got another Nova? Yep, of course you do. Of uh, fucking course you do. Ah, oh, I'm getting my ass beat right now! I got one fu- I got a summon skull. But people, I got a fucking summon skull. Look at this, look at this, look at, look at this, look at this. Like, do not even try to compare! Holy shit. And of course he gets like multiple fucking Novas and shit. Like, I'm still gonna lose. And I tried to make the deck faster. So, you know, we're running like, you know, multiple red eyes and the card of red jewels and stuff like that. All them good cards, but there's no way in fuck I'm gonna be Knights. No way in fuck. I'm I'm so out resourced, so out resourced, out resourced and outclassed. At least he only has one more Nova. At least I could be thankful about that. Still gonna get fucked up though. You gonna go into Triv or you gonna go into Delta? It's probably gonna go into Triv. This card says this is card sent from the field to graveyard. So if he goes to Triv and he picks it out of my hand, then I don't get the effect either. Holy shit. Yeah, that's the interesting thing. I have Teller Knights and I'm getting my ass beat like this. Uh, sure, I'll activate his effect and go ahead and search. So I have a 50-50 chance right now. He can either pick out the fucking Summon Skull, or he can pick out the Red Eyes Fusion with Triv. That he's gonna go into in main phase 2 after he smacks me in the face with Altair. Just completely outclassed, like... See, look at this. Look at this. And you, you know, and you want to compare to freaking... You know, people are, you know, Red Eyes Tier 1, like, are you seeing this ass beating that I am receiving? This isn't even the top deck. Oh, you got third Nova? Yeah, he's just in there. You and deck. So I'm not you. You're not terrible. And there it is. And I am proceeding to, uh, get my ass beat. I'm completely outclassed. Like, there, there's no comparison. How is how is this deck gonna be tier one, even up there when Teller Knights are fucking just kicking the shit out of me? Like, look at this shit. Look at this shit. Why am I even still in this duel? I could quit and get another duel. And I'm just wondering what's taking him so long to beat me. Like, clearly he should have already ended this duel already. Just go into a triv. Put everything back. Get your fiendish chain back.
Wow. All right, raise your hand if you saw that coming. No? Anybody? No? Okay. Holy shit. So, uh, pretty much I cannot do anything. I can set this. I'm, at least I'm getting these uh, black metal dragons. They're doing okay. So he has five. Now he drops to four, so I still can't summon. So I can't, I can't summon for pretty much two turns. If anybody saw him coming, I thought he was just going to go into Triv. This man is fucking with me. Fuck you, Daniel. <laughs> that sounds weird to say. It really does. That sounds weird to say. Fuck you, Daniel. Like, hello? I'm Daniel. Shit, I don't fucking know. It doesn't fucking matter. I'm going to lose. <laughs> oh, my God. Sure, give me that. It doesn't matter. I'm going to fucking lose anyway. This man went into this, because why the fuck not? Well, Kinka is interesting. It's just I really can't pull off the play right now. <sighs> I mean, I can show you guys the play. You guys might think it's interesting. Oh, right, I can't normal summon or do anything. Forgot about that. I guess I'll just set this card and, and sit here and get my ass beat some more. Like... I said this card is like really their their best some of their best plays. This card is actually pretty interesting. If I could actually get an opportunity to show you guys the power of this, alright, that's it. This one's definitely it. Let's get another dueling. Be right back. Alright, back. See, this is one of the reasons why I wanted to uh not have this deck on here, but more play it on this hands is once again not the best. There's a lot of shit that can clog me, but at least I got some red eyes fusions. I take the duel slow. There's really no point in going into a first turn, you know, black archfiend dragon. There's really no point. The reason why I wanted to mm, use it on uh, Deanna and not here. Ooh. Okay, well, at least Gun will get you a Lin back, but wow, you pitched Lin and stuff? Okay. I can handle that with a red eyes fusion, unless you want to use lead effect to pick something out of my hand, in which case I really don't care. <laughs> you know, just drawing summon skulls and you bells. That's that's the problem with this deck, is that you know it just increases the shit that I'm gonna draw that's bad. Like it just tenfold just increases it even more. And I don't want that to happen, but yeah. You know. Oh, okay. Your plays are interesting to say the least. Like I said, I'm hoping you're pitching. No, you're not even pushing for an OTK. I thought you were going to push for an OTK. Because right now, you used up a ton of resources. An ass ton of resources. Go ahead and activate that. Yep. Send a red ass in there. And again, I summon Skull for my deck. Summon Archfiend. Cook them with this. Not really. Should I be worried about the next shark? You touch the turtle. Once per turn, you can touch on the key material, then target one water monster you control this. Okay, so I pretty much want to kill him because he can make him attack me directly. So, you need to die, sir. Let's kill you. And then at the end of my battle phase, is that how it works? Yeah, at the end of my battle phase, I can return the red eyes and burn you for 24 and return it. That's very powerful. Very powerful. <sighs> yeah. This guy overextending with that play that he just did and all that wasn't necessary. Is that the reason why he did it? So he could soul charge? Like, okay. I'm gonna find it really interesting for you to get over this 38 beater without, you know, without attacking and you know, only summoning threes. So I guess you're gonna go into that that Marmel XC lady. I don't even know what she does off the top of my mind. Damn. It's 
So, are you going on the defensive? Because if you're going on the defensive, I'm going to win. Because literally, I'm just going to activate another red eyes fusion, summon another one, attack you, and then return the red eyes. You're going to get burned for a game. So, <sighs> nope, you're going to get burned. All of them. XC. Show me what you got. Her. Okay. During the opponent's turn, where your opponent targets exactly one face up normal monster you control for attack or with a spell trap effect. Except during demo step, you can touch on your tail that attack now attacks this card. When this card is a strength target, you can target one more monster in your graveyard, except for try and special summon that target. Okay. So you still lose. You most definitely still lose. See, that's a dumb thing, is that you can activate multiples. Keep drawing damn summon skull. I'll just say, when this card is drawn, you can tell you one more moment you go back except for her and summon it. No, kill it, bitch. It's not like she can activate. I'll kill you too. Yep, you're dead too. You're dead, son. You're dead. Sure. Activate. You turn the red eyes, and then that's game. <laughs> wow, that's a bad Mermel player. We'll get another dueling. Be right back. All right, we're back, and we're dueling against Horny Brother. These are names, though. <laughs> so, testing things out. Am I the only one? And I must be. Am I the only one that doesn't like Blackstone of Legend? I do not like that card. Like, there is... There, I don't... I do not like that card. There's nothing about that card that I like. Give me the Aggressor, because I got a Summon Skull. Once again, I drew Summon Skull every single duel. Normal Summon, not Special Summon. Activate you, pitch you, drop you bell. Uh, I, I don't know. I just, I don't like Blackstone. Like, Summon a Red Eyes from my deck. Like, ooh, that's so fucking good, you know? I'm thinking of it. I'm running, right now, I'm, I have it at one in the deck. I don't know you don't like it at one. I'm just I'm just sitting here thinking about it. I'm just like, what what, what do you do? Summon a red eye from my deck and like and I, I don't need you. I could put other shit in the deck, you know. Uh, I am liking Kinky Bio though. I, I didn't get to use uh, it's Kinka, I know, but I like saying Kinky Kinky Bio. Uh, pretty much, you summon it. You can summon a. Oh my God, are you fucking shitting me? You're fucking using Necros. Like wow. Well, you know what? I'm not gonna talk against fucking Necros. We search for a neck. Like wow, wow. See, this is this is the problem with dueling on Dep Pro instead of uh, instead of DN is that my rating is the same as everybody's rating, so I'm gonna be asking for it. You know, I go and rate it on, on in DN. There's, there's a pretty good chance that I'm just gonna be dueling against you know uh, you know lower tier decks, you know decks that aren't even you know that good. But when I come on here, I'm just screaming, just fucking use Necros and fucking use Telenites and fucking get in my butt. So let's get another dueling. Bear right back. All right. So, like I was saying about Kinky Bio, it summons a, a level one from my graveyard. It's a beast, and it can summon out summon a dragon, right? Which is actually pretty go good. We're, of course, we're running Sacred Sword. So, pitch, draw, pitch, draw, draw, draw. It's pretty much, I'm trying to make it kind of a draw engine. That's the that's gist, anyway. It seems like I need more revival for Red Eyes. Like I said, I'm still testing out the deck, but it seems like I need more revival for Red Eyes. Once I get, like, it out... It seems like there's there's other I could pull off our play so now since I know what I got to fix on the deck I can get to that this deck doesn't have enough red eyes for, ugh, I would say this deck doesn't have enough red eyes this deck doesn't have enough revival for red eyes you know this would be nice but I don't even have a red eyes on the field so I'm gonna pitch you because I might draw into something so you, you know so I can't even use this because I don't have red eyes at all in the duel right now so more revival for red eyes. I can send the red eyes, but I need I need to uh, revive it so I can start using return of red eyes better. So right now, I have a red eyes on the field. If I had a red eyes on the field, maybe we could talk, but nope. Nope, nope, nope. <sighs> anyway, Kinky Bio summons black, uh, you know, black metal dragon. Okay. Okay. I was hoping I would chop deck that. 
I was hoping I would top deck that. No, he's the ones in my deck. So Red Eyes Fusion is putting in that work, of course, because it's like the best card that they have. Can't do anything when I attack. You get wrecked. Swiggity swiggity. Turn that. So, I have one of the most interesting plays in effect now, because this card is counted as Red Eyes uh, B Dragon, so I can activate Return of Red Eyes, Return of Red Eyes, because summons a normal monster, so I can actually summon Doom Shaman. I have Tinker, Doom Shaman, summon Tinker, and then bam, sink eight. So, you know, I have plays, and interesting plays in my opinion. But uh, Kinky Bio summons uh, Black Mother Dragon, and then you can actually, instead of just leaving it like that, in a, or Xing or something, you can actually contact Fuse into Beast Eyes. One Dark Dragon, two Dragon type monster, of course this, and Beast type monster. Must be fusion from something about today, tributing the above card you call and counter another another way, so it's contact, you don't use poly. And uh, this card will get its effect. So instead of going Kinky Bio, summon back this and then be like, hey, well, and then Kinky Bio return back to the hand and you leave this, which is you know totally fine. You can actually go ahead and contact in the Beast Eyes Pendulum Dragon, which is a 3,000 beer, you know, not terrible. And also Kinky Bio is interesting because if I'm sitting on Terra, then I can go, you know, Kinky Bio summon this back and then poke and then Kinky Bio return back to the hand and, you know, avoid the Terra wipe. And then when Terra wipes, he'll kill the Black Metal and I get to search the Black Metal. See, so Kinky Bio seems like it's going to have some interesting plays. Uh, you know what, sure, I'll go ahead and equip you. You know, Blackstone on the other hand, I'm just like... You know, besides like Return of Red Eyes, like really, what am I doing? Summon Doom Shaman. This is also... You know what, you know what, I actually want to do another play. I can actually summon Summon Skull and I have M7, so... Summon Skull is level 6, Doom Shaman is level 6, bam. You know, you do that play too. Uh... You know, we have some interesting plays, I want to say. Go ahead and summon Tinker. So, pretty much every single turn I can go ahead and do that. Yeah, I'm going to Scrap Dragon. See, when the plays start working, you, you start to see it, right? It starts to come to fruition. You know what? Yeah, I'll take that. Oh, I'm going to shuffle my deck anyway. You know what? Fuck it. I'll do the scrap dragon effect later. Alright, you attack. Can't play anything. You attack. Mirror Force? Okay, that's fine. I got greedy. That's fine. I was like, is it Mirror Force? You can't activate the Mirror Force when I attacked with the, this guy. Can he only be fusion summoned? No, he could just be summoned. Wow. Pitch you. Pitch you. Drop two. Mm, no, it's fine. Go ahead to make this again. Summon another one. Maybe need to increase summon skull of three just in case I need to summon three in the duel. But I should be able to just use revival, you know? I can't activate this. If you control a red eyes monster, except we don't need to. I control the red eyes. Control the red eyes monster, except no, you could target one normal monster, but I for something to. Hmm. I have no idea why I can't activate that. Probably return drop return the red eyes down to uh down to uh one. It's not necessary to have multiples right now. Run you, put that back. Set that. Go ahead. So this guy is completely fucking up this Naturia because, you know, all his monsters are floating and you can't activate anything, which is just awesome. Okay, well now I can activate, you know, Return of Red Eyes. Which is interesting to say the least. So I guess I'll summon back Doom Shaman, because why not? So, Goblinburg, summon this, all right. XE to Utopia. 
Okay. Control is destroying for one person monster opponent controls that has the lowest attack. With time, you get to choose and put damage to your opponent. You can destroy monsters' attack. Nah, that's fine. <laughs> that's totally fine. <laughs> you can have that, Danny, what I'm at. Totally chill right now. Ultimate Nightmare, great draw. See, that's why Dark Reaper is so valuable, Miss that. Can activate the back, and you're dead. Activate him, turn the red eyes, and that is game. Unless you have some way of negating his effect. Excusable one, that's cute. So in Utopia, put a material on it. Alright, you're still gonna lose, though. And you lose. <laughs> Alright, so, like I said, you see the plays. You see it. On paper, you see it. You know, uh, like I said, I need to tweak the deck a little bit more. I want to get, I want to get red eyes. I thought I'm right now. I'm running triple red eyes and triple the Gemini monster just to make sure that my card of you know thing is always live. But it seems like they're a little bit cloggy, so I might drop down each down to two and still keep you know the triple card red duel and especially since I can search them with um, uh, black metal dragon. So if I need to, I can just go ahead and search them and then pitch them to draw. So. I might change that. I need to get some revival for red eyes. That's pretty. That's pretty much what I need. You know, uh, I didn't want to throw in like swing of memories and stuff like that. I wanted to step away from that, but I could, you know, throw in like Silent Doom swing of memories. So you know, I can go the Doom Shaman Tinker route. But you know, if I have like Return of Red Eyes, I can go, you know, activate Swing Summon Red Eyes, activate Return of Red Eyes, Summon another Red Eyes, and go for the XC Monster. Uh, this guy, this card can go down to one. It's not necessary right now. Limberverse is at two, just because. I don't really summon you bell that often, but uh, I mean, it can summon black metal dragon, so I guess it's good. And I'll probably take out uh, Blackstone because I just don't like that card. Like, with Blackstone, if all I'm doing is literally summoning a red eyes to tribute to summon a red eyes, then ooh, you know, like, I guess it'd be okay with Return of Red Eyes if I had Return of Red Eyes, but that's the only time, so you know, I'd rather just send it to the graveyard and then, you know, run some more revival cards instead. So. Uh, it's coming together. It's coming together. If you guys have any suggestions for the deck, uh, go ahead and tell me in the comment section below. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of Webcam Duels. See, the deck is a little bit better. So uh, thanks for watching. Thanks for all support. And I will see you guys next time. Still working on this deck. All right, people. Thanks for watching.